you guys, we're getting ready to go to Corey's favorite place. We're going to the Utah State Fair. He'll see, it's gonna be fun. You can put his shoe on. There's no way. Hi, sweetie. Oh, are you looking at the show? We're missing a shoe. Everyone, find Zoe's shoe. Go get it, Zozo, it's right there. Go get your shoe. Not that one, go get it. Emmy, what do you wanna do at the fair? Animals? Look how some people are there. Yeah. There's a lot of people. So that's good because she's scared of dark clouds and she thinks if there's dark clouds, there's no people outside. Wow. Yeah. And so if there's a lot of people, it means it's safe, she thinks. There's no dark clouds, Em. If you look outside, do you see any clouds out there? Uh oh. Uh oh. It's going to be a hot day. It's not fall yet. <laughs> and it's 79 degrees, it's fall. Yeah. It's not fall yet. Yes, it is. Wowzers. <laughs> Screamer, whiner, hitter. That's what they do. She's scared of dark clouds. Oh. Because, she wor because she's worried that Bowser's coming. But Bowser's not real. Yeah. But Bowser's not in our world. She's ready to go from head to toe. Look how handsome he is. From head to toe, he's a handsome boy. Hi, bud. Smile. <laughs> what happened to your nose? <gasps> she has a scratch on it and she scraped it again. No, leave it on. It is bleeding. The top of it. Cause she keeps clawing it with her finger. Oh. You look like a little you? you look like a baby duck. Yeah. Oh. We have made it. It was a rough ride here, guys. Cause we have babies that now get sick. Poor Zoe. She threw up all over her clothes. I only had one shirt that I had in the car, luckily. But she has no pants. Now they don't match. So sad. These two looked like they were gonna throw up too though, so. Oh boy. That's what you want to ride? If you're tall enough to go alone. Okay, barely. Where are you going to ride? Um, you got your tickets? Yeah. Yeah. They want to ride. Is that cool, Lincoln? Job. Go choose your car. The purple one's over there. Hurry. Emmy! Are you ready? Did you see Emmy? Is this right? Yeah. Pig. Do you want to pet the pig? There's one right here, Anne. 
Candy. Oh my goodness. This is a bad place to bring them. Mine. Mine. Give Lexi some. Give Lincoln some more. Thank you for sharing, Emmy. Dad of the year right here. It's got all the kids. <laughs> well, that was so much fun, right, Cor? Yeah. <laughs> I kind of see where Corey's coming from now. I mean, I grew up loving fairs, but... We spent over $100. That was expensive. <laughs> for nothing. Uh, and it was like all on food and stuff and treats and, I mean, one ride for $4. But Emmy said she had the best day ever, right? It's a money trap. They are money traps. Corey was saying we could go to Disneyland and we wouldn't spend that much once we were in the park, you know? Like you spend more up front, like, but you have more entertainment and you can go on any yeah. ride you want. But the kids had fun. Thanks for coming along on our fair adventure. Yeah. Comment below if you are a fair person and if you like going to fairs and what you love so much about it. Maybe we're just missing out on what's so amazing about it. I mean, it changes things when you have three babies and you can't really do much, but yeah, it was still fun, but definitely too much money. You need a bath because you're a sticky mess. You need a bath because you threw up. You're pretty good, but you're gonna have one because they need a bath. <laughs> what are you girlies doing? Good job. <laughs> <laughs>